Tampa, Kansas. Officers set up hidden cameras to catch a gang of drug dealers. They've been stealing powerful anhydrous ammonia from these tanks, a key ingredient in crystal meth. There's probably been two months we set up there, and there'd be a few nights we'd get called away, and sure enough, we'd check the cameras the next day, and they'd been there after we had left. So it was getting frustrating. Despite the painstaking efforts of officers like Josh Whitwell, the meth heads have eluded capture. We planned on just calling it quits, taking our cameras down and moving on to the next project. We needed to cut our losses. But on the last night of the stakeout, Whitwell and Sergeant Jeff Sawyer hit pay dirt. We were probably 50 yards from us. They didn't see us. While they were stealing the anhydrous and walking around, I was making phone calls to the sheriff. The gang, led by two-time felon Justin Fuqua, loads up and takes off. As soon as they started to leave, I turned my lights on. And the chase was on. Feeling the heat, the gangsters do the unthinkable. I could see the guy in the back seat. He was opening the nozzle to his anhydrous hose that was hooked to his tank. I thought, there's, there's no way that he's going to point this at me. There's, there's no way. The desperate felons do just that. The toxic smoke screen quickly overwhelms Sergeant Sawyer. Inhaling anhydrous ammonia takes away all the moisture from your eyes, your mouth, your throat. So you feel like you're, you're being microwaved on the inside of your body. From out of nowhere, the pursuit takes a bizarre turn. And all of a sudden, there's cows in the middle of the road. The crazed druggies plow through the herd, clipping one cow's leg. I uh, stepped on the gas and closed my eyes and made it through there. Still battling the noxious fumes, Sawyer spots an opening and goes for it. Right off the road, right off the road. A shower of sparks, a perfect pit, and the getaway car is sent spinning into a ditch. The suspects are stopped, but danger still hangs in the air. Ignoring the volatile gas all around him, the driver actually lights up a cigarette. I don't know if he wanted to blow up or what, but that was just his reaction. Despite the risk, the officers move in. Luckily, the flame, along with the gang's escape, is extinguished. After we had the suspects into custody, I, had, I felt a big relief that everything was over. Because of the persistence of these fearless cops, local meth heads have been put on notice. Drive off the road! 